If you're looking to change your relationship with food, then this video is for you. Here's how your human design chart can show you what, when, or how to eat. Human design is an empirical system that uses your birth, date, time, and location to create a strategic map of your energy, which includes how to take care of your physical body. If you're not familiar with your specific design yet, you can find it by going here or clicking on my face. By the way, if you don't know me already, my name is Tanji. I'm a human design reader. I'm the feel good expert, and I use human design to help you feel good or at least feel a little better. Once you've pulled your human design chart, you're just going to want to scroll down to the section that says digestion. If it says consecutive or alternating, you are looking for simplicity in your diet, meaning you would do a lot better with a single apple than a fruit salad. It is the quality of ingredients over the quantity. If it says open or closed, you're looking for repetition in your diet. So this means find something that you like and give yourself permission to eat the same thing over and over again every day. It's really okay and your digestive system likes it. If it says hot or cold, the most important thing for you to focus on is temperature. You use foods and drinks to help regulate the temperature of your body and keep you in homeostasis. If it says calm or nervous, then the atmosphere in which you eat is the most important. So it's really important for you to be able to like set the scene before you sit down to have a meal, whether that is like an exciting and buzzing scene or a scene where you're able to really mellow out and chill. If it says high or low, then volume or the sound of your surroundings is the most important. So again, we're setting the scene based on the volume um, of the room that you're in. So if it's high sound, you want like really um, music playing and, and more activity. And if it's low sound, you need complete silence. If it says direct or indirect, then it's the time of day in which you eat that matters the most. So someone may be designed to eat most of their meals when the sun is down or later in the evening or in the daytime and in direct sunlight if possible. So what's your digestion and how did this land for you?